Who's your baby? You're the baby, aren't ya? You're a good baby. Look at this man. Look at this baby man. Hey. Jax, I shall give you a boop. Boop. Thank you. Good afternoon, everyone. It is <laughs> May 26th. I'm going in for my second day of work. Yay. Or I'm just gonna sit on my ass the whole time. Yeah, I saw the uh, new Rescue Rangers movie. It was fun and funny. Like in one scene you see, instead of it being Mrs. Doubtfire, I love how they like brought in that little cameo right there, Mrs. Doubtfire, but it's Mr. Doubtfire with Meryl Streep. That was awesome. And then like right after that, you see Dobby in a Gucci ad. Like Dobby the house elf in a Gucci ad. Fucking hilarious. I'm just thinking of 3090 from, uh, I think it's Andrew Garfield's musical or whatever it's called. They say me happy birthday, you just want to lay down and cry. It's either that or something from Amphibia, which I've never watched. It's 1219, I gotta leave around 1 o'clock or 1230 because as you guys have seen when I went up last time, I was like, took me an hour, almost an, like half an hour to get there. Jax, what are you doing? He's drinking. And I've messed up on this eye already. I just gotta let it dry because if I wash it off now, my entire face. See what I mean? I'm turning into goddamn Harley Quinn here. It's kind of easy to tell which side has makeup and which one doesn't. I don't want to grab a jacket, but at the same time, I'm like, I should probably grab one. In the car, finally. It's fucking boiling hot in here. I hope that stays on. Oh, shit. That's gonna be one bumpy ride for you guys. Thank you, UPS truck, for literally sitting right in front of my driveway. That is not one safe driver. Because he just like sped right off. Yesterday wasn't my best day driving because holy shit, I almost crashed at least five times. Like, I don't mean like crash crash. I mean like I was paying attention to like somebody else coming in my direction. I wasn't paying attention to the lane right beside it and almost caused a few crashes. So that was fun. <sighs> oh, chill. It's fucking my glasses. What time is it? It is 12.56. It takes about a half an hour to get there. My shift doesn't start until 2. So yeah, uh, on a Tuesday was my first shift. And today is my second shift, which is literally just training. So where I just sit on my ass and on a computer. But there were so much training videos I had to do. I had to get my Wemyss out again. I had to do Wemyss training again. If you don't know what Wemyss is, it's chemicals and all that. You have to know all these different chemicals and all these signs for the chemicals and all that. Oh yeah, this one is flammable. Or like, this one can cause corrosion. Like, all that sort of shit. And this one, explosive if... So yeah, that was, that was fun. I have a delivery driver behind me. I drove the uh, Highlander the other day, which is our other vehicle. Pick up Maxim. That was fun. But yeah, as you guys can see, I have my hair fixed, finally. My, my sides are finally done. I hate going down here at this time because, like... Traffic. You saw that in, um, like, that vlog? Okay, it's one o'clock. An hour before my shift starts. Did that person seriously just do a U-turn? Motherfucker. Person, you are so fucking impatient. Water, don't spill. Don't spill water. Please do not spill. Okay, good. My water did not spill. Something that I like about this job, even though like I haven't actually started working yet, is that I get paid more than minimum wage. By like $3, which isn't much. But I, I get paid, at least. This is a horror movie that's called Winnie the Pooh 
blood and honey. Will you be watching this? No! I will not be watching this new Winnie the Pooh movie. I don't want to scar myself. Something I will never understand. Sorry, I'm going everywhere. I did take my medication, I promise. People who have small boobs are like, oh my gosh, I really want big boobs. And I'm like, you do not want big tits. Let me tell you. Like, big tits is hell, okay? You get boob sweat. You get back aches. It's just awful, let me tell you. But yeah, tomorrow I'm working on the floor at night, computer training. And then, uh, on Saturday I'm working, and the thing is, on those two shifts, it's from 9 to 1, and I'm like, god damn, I'm gonna have to wake up at 7 in the fucking morning, because like around that time, this this area, oh, and then rabbit, like this area around that time isn't as bad, you know? I smell weed. It's easy for me to like distinguish weed from other smells, and my mom is like, how the fuck are you able to tell that, and I'm like... Oh, is that new tundra? It's only 113. Holy shit. I am a sweaty fuck. This is car. Doesn't have any air conditioning. Yay! No stopping on tracks. You don't know shit. It's only 117. My shirt is sticking to my fucking back. I am a sweaty motherfucker right now. Person, why are you moving up with them? The fuck? There we go. Finally fucking done that. My back is like probably changing a different color. Holy shit, I am. I'm gonna text my dad being like, hey, look what I found in the car. I'm back in the car, sitting down longer. Helicopter. Holy fuck. Hips fucked. Love that for myself. But yeah, tomorrow I head in at for a 9 a.m. shift. My gut hurts. The reason why my stomach does hurt, or my abdomen hurts like a bitch, is because I need to fucking eat. Yeah, I didn't. I thought I would get all the rest of the training done today, but nope. So I'm on the floor tomorrow. There's nothing really much to talk about training for my job because, again, the training is literally me just sitting on my ass currently. This time I'm in the right lane. Or technically the left lane, not the right lane, but this time I don't have to accidentally turn that way. Okay, I'm finally up to speed, and then I have to go all the way down from 90 to 50. Like, what the fuck? Tomorrow I have to wake up around 7 to get to work at 9. But I'm gonna have to drive in heavy duty boots. That's gonna be fun. The Matrix Resurrections. I've already seen it. It came out on my birthday. Well, funny thing is, all my friends, or technically one, uh, have been able to go out and drink on their birthdays when they turn 19. Me, I'm turning fucking 21 this year and still haven't been able to go to a bar to drink. You are a fucking idiot. I'm gonna be legally able to drink in the States, and I still haven't gone to a bar for my birthday. Because every time my birthday happens, everything gets shut down because COVID cases keep rising, and then like the bars are all closed, and I'm like, God fuck, can I please just have one birthday where I'm able to go out and drink? Please! So like, that's, that's what's happening with me. Yeah, I'm going to be legally able to drink in the States, like that is awesome. I, I, I don't know how to feel about it, because like, they have some beverages there that I've never heard of. Probably. Quick question, if you're able to drink, what's your favorite kind of shot? I like the porn star and a Jaeger bomb. Apparently there's a drink at this local bar downtown, and one of their drinks is called, uh, like, oh, what is it? like? visiting Elvis or something like that and I'm just like oh my fucking god there was also another one where it's like ah uh, what is it RBV yeah it's called RBV where it's like Red Bull and vodka that's the entire drink is Red Bull and vodka I like the porn starch it's funny how I go from talking about uh
friend's dad, Phoenix's dad, makes the best caramel shots. Huh! It has, uh, I don't even remember what's even in it. All I remember is that the topic is Baileys, vanilla Baileys. I could die. Also, that reminds me, I never got to take that Bailey shot that my grandparents had at their house. I was gonna take it, but I didn't. I forgot about it until I got home. I was like, I never got to take the Bailey shot. Because nobody in my family likes Baileys but me. I am the only one in my fucking family who likes Baileys. Because a lot of my family doesn't like anything too creamy or they're beer drinkers. And then there's me. I'm like, I like Baileys. Like, give me an entire bottle of Baileys for Christmas and I'm gonna be happy. Kid, the fuck are you doing? Running out in front of fucking cars? The fuck? The fuck are people doing? The fuck are these people doing? They're being fucking idiots. the least feminine person I could ever think of. Least feminine person ever. Me.